So I have felt bad more than I have felt good. There have been many nights I couldn't sleep, have cramps in my legs, cramps in my hands, cramps in my back. There were many, many nights I would fall asleep and I swear I'd wake up five minutes later. Other times I'd be sound asleep. I could hear myself breathing deep in my sleep, but I'd wake up. I'd run to the bathroom and go pee. And then I'd come back and then lay down and try to get some more sleep. I did stay up late a lot watching, uh, binge watching actually, watching uh, the uh, Walking Dead series, the um, uh, the Fear of the Walking Dead series, all that good stuff. And I don't know, I think maybe I'd been dreaming a little bit about that. Other times I think maybe I was just suffering from maybe some kind of lack of mineral or vitamin or some kind of, I don't know, some kind of deficiency of some sort. Other nights, I honestly feel like maybe my intestines were giving me problems, maybe my chest, maybe uh, anxiety, stress, other odds and ends like that, but I haven't <clears throat> I haven't been doing the videos and posting them here on YouTube the exactly the way that I thought I would, and as timely as I thought I would. I go to work, I come home. The days are getting shorter. <laughs> I get up in the morning, I get in the car and go to work. You know, the sun's just now coming up. When I get off work and I get in the car to come home, the sun's going down. So the days are getting shorter. You know, the season, the cold, colder season is coming along. And uh, so in those days, I, I don't go outside and I don't do anything. Uh, I do a little bit. I might go out and put, put the chickens up, check on them, feed the cats. You know, that's about it. I don't do much outside. During my work week, my work days, on on the days that I'm off of work, um, sometimes I sleep later in the mornings. You know, usually I'm usually up around five fifteen, uh, five a.m., five fifteen a.m. on my work days. Other times, um, like on my days off, I'll sleep late. You know, sometimes I'll get up at say eight or eight thirty a.m. Some days I sleep and sleep and sleep, uh, depending on how I'm feeling. Uh, if I've stayed up late the night before uh, binge watching, uh, you know, the, uh, the Walking Dead series and all that and uh, everything, then, you know, I'd, I'll probably sleep late the next day. And when I say sleep late, I don't mean like until the afternoon or something like that. I mean until, I don't know. 8.30 or 9, maybe 9.30. Um, sometimes I dream. Sometimes I dream some of that crazy stuff I saw on TV. Sometimes I, my mind's just going and, and I'm worried about things. I'm worried about my job. I'm worried about my finances. I'm worried about my health. I'm worried about my family members and all of them and, you know, how things are going with them. And other times I'm just you know, thinking about all the different things I'd love to do, you know, things like that. I'd love to be able to go and do, you know, some things that I've never been able to do before. And, you know, it really, really, you know, after several days of not getting enough sleep, you know, you, I kind of get run down. I, I get kind of physically, um, run down, emotionally run down, um, psychologically run down. 
um, I, I really start to feel it in me, and I feel kind of like I really, really need to get out there and and you know do some projects, get some fresh air and sunshine, and uh, even if it's chilly or cold out, you know I still need to be able to get out there and go do some things. Uh, feel like I'm accomplishing something and make videos and. I guess what this video is probably about is self-motivation. You know, I need to be able to motivate myself to be able to get up and get out there and do things. I need, I need to, you know, now that the days are shorter, I actually need to get out there and do things like in the workshop or, or in in the camper. You know, that that Airstream camper. I need to work on. I need, I need to run some electricity to it and I need to have lighting in there and I need to have a heat source so I can be in there and actually do uh, the projects that I want to do and that I need to do. Um, in the cottage, I, I need to do work on the cottage. I need to I need to build out the back side of the cottage and turn it into a livable space and I need to do, you know, carpentry work uh electrical work uh plumbing i need to do all that i need i need to put in insulation and i need to make it work and i need to put in windows and doors and other odds and ends and i, I really need to get around to that and i need to make a whole series of videos but i've been feeling physically unfit feeling like i really need to focus on my health and to get myself back to where I was, say, six months ago. I need to motivate myself to, you know, to actually get out and do all the different things that I need to do. And sometimes, sometimes it's just not easy. Sometimes I just got to, you know, just do it. And, and I guess that's what this video is about, is just pushing myself to have that motivation to get out and do it. Make another video. Post another video. And I, I, I guess I'm just trying to sh tell everybody else that, you know, I go through it. You go through it. We all go through it. We all go through this lack of motivation, this wondering, you know, is it worth it? You know, should I continue? You know, should I take the time to, to make another video to post to YouTube? What, what will I do next time? I came up here and I sat down in front of the laptop computer and started playing with the, uh, the, uh, the, the camera thing on it, the, 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 um, microphone trying to get it all work right together so that i can come up here and just sit and dab at at the uh at the uh, computer you know and be able to come up with ideas make a video and post it so that's what i've been doing i guess it's a type of motivational video in a way maybe uh, let me know what you think in the comments below.